Hey, Hi. peeps. Hi. This is Charisma. <laughs> I'm Cole. <laughs> You're so weird. I, I, know, I know. I'm sorry. So there uh, are a lot of new people on our channel from the past month or month or two, even a little bit longer than yeah, that. Yeah, especially from the Snapchat feature that we had, which was awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, and a surprise. Yes. Uh, so we wanted to do something a little bit different uh, for this post this week. Mm -hmm. um, and a lot of this is driven by how busy we are and we have a, a TED talk coming up that we still have a lot of memorization to do. Yeah. But um, what we wanted to do, and this is all Charisma's idea, was share our old How We Met video, which is the second video on our channel. A video that's from over a year and a half ago. It's so far down there, and we noticed that we get a lot of comments, people asking, you know, how we met, how long we've been dating, mm -hmm. uh, how old are we, and you know, all these questions that are answered in this video. So we thought, why not just share this video again, you know, mm -hmm. give a little intro do, to it and then share it again so that people can see our How We Met video. And if you've mm -hmm. already seen it, why, go ahead and watch it again, you mm -hmm. know? It was weird for us watching it because mm -hmm. we look so young. I know. It's wild. Babies! And you can tell we had that cute little puppy love in yes. the beginning, which I guess we still have. But like, yeah. back then it was so fresh and... So new. So new. Yeah, so, so it's fun. Now. It is fun. So... If you're new to this channel and you haven't subscribed yet, or if you've been around for a long time and you still haven't subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Yes, it's a huge help for us. Mm -hmm. It's totally free. You can unsubscribe whenever you want. And hopefully you don't. <laughs> hopefully you don't, but it's not like you're beholden to anything. And uh, surprisingly, 55% of our watch time is from people who aren't subscribed to our channel, yeah. which um, seems like a lot. So mm -hmm. please consider subscribing. Yes. Again, totally free mm -hmm. and it is uh, very helpful. Yes. So appreciate it. And also if you want a little bit of dose of positivity throughout mm -hmm. your week and a little bit of cold and charisma, mm -hmm. hit that notification bell as well. It'll mm -hmm. notify you every time we post a video, which is not that often. So don't, I mean, it's often enough, mm -hmm. but it's not every day. So you won't get notification mm -hmm. bells every day. But we do every Sundays and Wednesdays, so you'll get that notification bell so you're not behind. Yes. Also, we are very active on Instagram, too. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty much our most active platform outside of YouTube. Mm -hmm. That's, again, mostly charisma. <laughs> so <laughs> um, my Instagram right here, our Instagram like here somewhere, and then her Instagram right there. Maybe. Yeah. Yes. So, <laughs> so feel free to follow us. We're more active there, and we post daily there, so if you... Want to mm -hmm. see more daily things. As long as we have enough pictures. As long as we have, they're not hard to take usually. But. Yeah. Anyway, so we hope you enjoy this little throwback slash new video if you've never seen it before. Yeah, have fun. Yeah. We'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>
missed it. You did? You're just kidding? No, I missed it. You missed that? Yeah. We talked about why we're doing the vlog, mm -hmm. but I guess the second vlog, the first, the first place to start should be how we met. Exactly. A lot of people always ask us how we met, so. And we always answer the question differently. Yeah, we do. So how, how do you answer the question? <laughs> well, I work at Chelting Arms, an inpatient rehab facility, and Cole works out there, um, gets therapy with our NeuroFit program, and I talk Ignored me for about one and a half years. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, it's true. I did not notice him for a really long time. I had no clue who he was until my friend brought up his name, and I was like, wait, who's that? And she's like, you know, the kid that the dove kid. off the jet. The kid. <laughs> You're going to yeah, cut that funny. one up. <laughs> but she's like, you know, um, the guy that went to at Lee dove off the, the rack um, at the James River and broke his neck, and I was like, yeah, I don't remember that story. So one day I was... Um, helping out um, Neurofit and I asked them if they needed anything and Cole was on the bike getting electrical. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> he was on the bike getting therapy and um, they asked me if I could um, take off the pads and get him off the bike basically. So I went over to help him and he hated it because... <laughs> look, I look terrible when I go to workout. I'm not wearing my good clothes. I got pads all up. Like I feel like I'm a robot. <laughs> And she's going up in my pants and stuff. First time we were ever really interacted yeah. getting these pads off. Like, literally, you had to take one off my butt, I think. <laughs> so I was just like, oh, here, here's this cute girl. And, like, this is how we're going to meet? This sucks. <laughs> I didn't think anything of it because this is literally what I do every day. <laughs> so I was just like, oh, I'm just helping out this so guy get off, <laughs> get these pads off. And that was basically it and I asked him if he was going to the Shelting Arms Gala which right. was that weekend and he said he was and then I actually remember this he was like he asked me if I had a date and I was like yes I'm taking uh, Paige our co-worker and he looks at me and goes oh well I don't have a date <laughs> and I felt like that was like a little <laughs> I, well I mean I'm always throwing out a little flirt yeah you know? little hints <laughs> so th this is where my story begins because I don't I don't include the whole FES bike part <laughs> But uh, yeah, we, we met and we talked at the Shiny Night Gala and she was looking fine. You're wearing that like teal sort of dress. Yeah. Yeah. You had your your uh, cyber and like little pearl oh, thing. Oh yeah, I did have that. Yeah. <laughs> and so we I flirted with her a little bit there. And then that night she followed me on Instagram. Yeah. And I was like, ooh, <laughs> this could be the beginning. So I followed her back, liked some of her pictures. She liked a few of mine and yeah. then I hit her with a DM. Slid in my DMs just like that. Got no shame. But our <laughs> first date, what did you think was going on? Oh, so he invites me to his house for a bonfire with a bunch of his friends. So I was like, oh, okay. So I texted my friend Alex and I asked her to come because I didn't want to go to a random guy's house that I didn't know with a bunch of random people that I didn't know. Yeah, by myself. So she came with me and she texted me and she was like, so does this guy like you? Like, should I look out for signs or anything? And I was like, I don't think so. Like, I don't think he's into me. And she goes, are you sure? <laughs> and um, so she's like, okay, well, I'll come. So we were there for a little bit. And it was really fun. Like oh, I said, yeah. next to Cole. And that's actually where he brought up us going out on a date. Yeah. And um, I told him I'd never been to Texas Roadhouse. And he was like, well, we should go and then go Gotta to a go movie. To Texas Roadhouse. Yeah, it's like his favorite place. Mm -hmm. And then he was like, we should go and then go to a movie after that. So that's what we did. That's the origin story of me and Charisma. Yeah. Of role with Cole and Charisma. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> role with Cole and Charisma. <laughs> so we, we were just talking about like what standpoint I was coming from when I first asked out Charisma. And I, don't know, I, I think I felt a little more comfortable asking her out because she is in the rehab field 
and like you deal with people in wheelchairs all the time. Mm-hmm. So I mean that I think that's a fear for a lot of people in wheelchairs is like, what is this girl gonna think of me, like rolling around mm-hmm. and the extra work that might go into like having a good time. Yeah. Um, but with charisma, it, it was a little easier. I mean, it was different because. I'm so used to working with people in wheelchairs that I just saw Cole for Cole. And it wasn't Cole in a wheelchair. It was just Cole, you know? And and that's how it should be. It, exactly. I mean, it's how it should be. It, it's harder for people who haven't been around it all the time to get past it. Because yeah. everybody is naturally curious and they want to ask yeah. questions. Oh, why are you in a chair? What can you do? Like, how, do your hands work or do they not work? Yeah. Like, people are just naturally curious. So that sometimes that's a hurdle. When I'm When I'm asking a girl out I don't want them to hit me with a bunch of questions like oh so what does it mean to be a quadriplegic I just want you to flirt with me <laughs> yeah exactly and I feel like on our first date we talked about us like we didn't talk right. about his in- injury yeah. much which I really liked yeah like we just talked about us and had a good time he asked a lot of questions about me same with him and yeah canal walk so as you can see there's a lot of like cracks and everything everywhere which makes wheelchair navigating really hard so Cole often has to find himself yeah I gotta go this way yeah find himself like finding other ways to maneuver so we found like this little ramp for him to go down and not have to go through there so perfect Nice. <laughs> She's so strong. So do you want to know how Cole eats? His handy dandy fork. Show them your fork, Cole. This is my stabber, I like to call it. Pick it up by its little ring. Put it in my mouth. Put my finger through. And then I shovel food into directly into my mouth. Lots of it. <laughs> 